One of the most commonly asked questions I get is what do I put in my breakfast shake? So today I'm going to share with you how I am currently making my shake that I use to break my fast on a daily basis. The base that I use for my shake has not changed for the past 10 years. I've just changed the way I use my shake on a daily basis and now I'm using it to break my fast. So the shake base that I use is Shakeology. I do use the vegan formula and one of my favorite, favorite flavors, the cafe latte. So this is how we're going to make today's shake. So in my blender, I have already put in about a half a cup of water and about a cup of unsweetened almond milk. Now you can use any sort of liquid base that you want to use for a shake. Um, sometimes we use cashew milk, sometimes we use ripple milk. It just all depends on what we have in the house. So I have that going there. Um, I sometimes put ice in as well, but today I'm gonna to show you how I make my shake with a little frozen avocado. These are bags that we get from our local Costco, and we have been throwing in just frozen chunks of avocado into our shake just to add a little bit more fat to the base. So this is probably about a half a cup, maybe almost a cup of avocado chunks. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that in to my milk and my water. I also like to add in some nut butter. So today I'm going to be using Nutso. Um, I either swap between this, sometimes I put actual peanut butter in, or I might be putting in some sunflower seed spread. Uh, keep in mind, you wanna make sure that you're reading all the ingredients labels on anything that you're adding to your shake, making sure you're not adding too much sugar or ingredients that you do not want to consume. So I just have pre-scooped out here, probably uh, maybe two tablespoons of the Nutso nut butter, and so I'm gonna just drop that in. Again, this adds a nice little bit of protein and um, some good healthy fats into your shake, so I'll add that in there. And then I also add in a scoop of collagen. This is one of the new additions to my breakfast shake. This is a Beachbody version of collagen and it is specifically for um, skin and nails. So I'm gonna put this in. What I like about this version of collagen is it has less protein grams per serving. So I'm not overloading my body with too much protein with my breakfast shake. So one level scoop goes right in there like that. And then there are a couple other boosts that you can add to your Shakeology as well. If you want to add a little bit of extra fiber, they have a um, digestive health boost. They also have a power green, so you can add some dehydrated greens in it to your shake. But we also like to add the focused energy boost, and this also helps with mental clarity and cognitive function, and I'm always wanting to make sure I keep my fo uh, cognitive function um, at its best. So one scoop of that is gonna go in there as well. And then lastly, I'm going to add in my full scoop of the Cafe Latte Shakeology. So I'm gonna dump that right in there. And then we're gonna blend this up. Okay, that's nice and blended. The shake is really thick because of the frozen avocado that we added in there. But I also like to add in a little bit of salted roasted sunflower seeds as well. Adds like a little bit of crunch to my Shakeology and the salt is amazing with that cafe latte flavor. So I'm just gonna give this one more quick little whirl and I'm gonna check the consistency to see if I have to add any more water. Okay, so you can see my shake turned out a little thick. That's probably because my avocado was really frozen. So I'm just gonna add a little extra water to my Shakeology. Just thin it out a little bit there. And I really do just eyeball everything when I make my shake so it comes out different every single time. This looks pretty good. I'm gonna let it uh, run for just another second and then I'll pour it out. Okay, so this is what my shake looks like as a finished product. I like to serve it in a glass mason jar. Perfect every time, even though I eyeballed all the ingredients that I added to this. This is one complete nutrient dense meal for me. This gives me plenty of energy, curbs my appetite before I head into my next feast. This is what I break my fast with. I generally have about a four hour feasting window. So I'll have this and then dinner with my family. I get all the nutrients I need for my day. I will include all the information where you can check the ingredients list and check the nutrient value for this shake, at least the base part of it here. And then you can check all of the other ingredients that I put in as well. If this works for you, I'll put ordering information down below for you as well. And if you have any questions, always feel free to reach out to me.